So my name is Will Topf. I'm the uh, territory sales manager for the south half of Arkansas. Um, this is the uh, Haskell Fire Department 75 foot uh, Quint. Biggest thing I want to say is this truck is amazing. Uh, th this truck is amazing for so many different reasons. It's not, it's not just amazing because of the fit and finish. It's not just amazing because it was part of our stock truck program and we were able to get it in under six months delivery. Um, it's amazing because of the people. Uh, the hard work that went into it from all the people in Appleton, uh, our Pierce financing that made this possible. And through Pierce's in-house financing, we were able to uh, make it fit within the customer's budget to get them financed. And we have some very challenging financing uh, regulations in Arkansas, but uh, we were able to work through it. And it just, it's awesome seeing a project like this come together. It really is. So a couple of key features on this thing. This is a uh, Enforcer chassis. Uh, it's Pierce's most popular chassis as of right now. Um, if you look inside, you got vinyl seats. Um, you can't really see it from where we're at right now, but they've got controls for the uh, go lights up top. It's got dual go lights. Uh, it'll really fit their needs as far as the rural area that they cover, help cover the ditches, uh, a lot of overhead obstructions, things like that. So looking in the back, they did uh, the walkaway brackets for their SCBA seats. That'll make deployment a whole lot easier for them. So part of our stock truck program is this was already built up for them. So the stock truck team does such a great job of simplifying the process and they've built up so many units, they know what most fire departments need. So they put a Waterus 2000 GPM uh, pump on this unit. You got your Pierce control zone valves, you know, it's laid out perfectly. Uh, it's just nice and clean. Uh, I like the way that everything comes together. It's got our proprietary platform that we put on most of our aerials so that when it is jacked up, uh, the pump operator is not having to reach way over his head to operate the valves, you know, causing shoulder injuries, things like that. With it being a stock truck and us catching it early enough in the process, we were able to make some changes that made this truck fit to the customer, which was very, very nice. Um, one of them being the tool mounting boards in the back of the compartment. Uh, engineers' compartments typically are just very cluttered. Um, you see lots of valves and adapters and nozzles and things and without a good way to store it, it just gets piled in there. So adding a mounting plate is a huge benefit. A couple more compartments as we go back. Just tons of storage in this body. Did a couple of custom graphic changes for them. I think it turned out really nice. And if you see the truck now, actually, it's in the short jack configuration. So we've got one outrigger out the other side, which we don't even have to have with it being straight up. But this does show the capabilities. So if you're in a tight, uh, narrow area, narrow road, you know, maybe cars on both sides, this gives you a lot of utilization. All right, so on our 75 foot body, um, again, it's an aluminum ladder, uh, which was actually really important to them um, they've got guys that are on uh, full-time fire departments, other places, and this is kind of what they're used to, uh, and they know functionally how to operate it. But if you look, the way that our body is designed, you get a really nice ingress, egress off of the back of the body here. You've got good access to your ladders and pike poles on either side, as well as a super easily accessible aerial inlet that doesn't hang below the body like some trucks do. Um, keeps it protected from uh, any departure uh, hang-ups or anything like that. And the same story over here on this side, except you can see it with the, uh, the outrigger extended. Again, it's not a super long outrigger. Um, nice benefit of the H-style outriggers is if you have an obstruction or anything in your way, you can you have a lot more versatility with this versus other styles of outriggers. All 
right, so this bell's an addition that actually uh, took place at final inspection. As we were walking around looking at other apparatus, uh, the department realized that this was a uh, something that they would really like to have. It's nice because it's not so intrusive as an air horn or something if you have pedestrians in a walkway that you need to move out of the way. Plus it gives it a really good classic look. And it shows the versatility of add-ons that we can do with our stock truck program. Uh, you're not hamstrung, you know, into just the bare basics. You know, this is a very nice apparatus the way that it's set up. And I think that this is just a touch of class for the unit. Like I said in the beginning, this truck is amazing. It's amazing for so many different reasons, but really at the end of the day, it's amazing because of the people that it's gonna serve and all the work that all the people put to make this happen.